Good morning, Farmington. Today is Wednesday, May 8th. My name is Honorisa, bringing you the morning news. Today for lunch, we'll be having chicken strips, smart mouth pizza, roll, mashed potatoes, gravy, mixed veggies, fresh reservoir fruit, fruit juice, and milk. Seniors project graduation event night permission forms are in your class of 2024 page. Must be signed and returned by Tuesday morning, May 14th. Event night will be held at Local Motion Entertainment Center after graduation. The auditions for the 2024-2025 Christmas Select Ensemble have been extended through this week. This is the top performing choir in the district. You could sign up for an audition time on the clipboard in the front office. Times are available during first lunch and after school this week. Email Ms. Jackson for any additional questions. <clears throat> class of 2026 class officer elections. Please see Ms. Harp by Friday, May 10th to sign up to run for next year's junior class officers. A big congratulations to Tate Keegans and Lillian McCullough for receiving Silver Ribbon International finalists for their role play in hospitality and tourism team decision making at DECA's ICDC Farmington High School with the only Arkansas school that had students appear at the big stage. Students and staff there will be a hat day on May 17th to help out a family in need. This week is Mental Health Awareness Week. The focus of Mental Health Awareness Week is to raise awareness about mental health and mental illnesses, challenge stigmas, and misconceptions surrounding mental health issues and offer support and resources to individuals affected by mental illness or those who support them. Mental health is the overall well-being of your mind, which includes emotional, psychological, and social it is how we think, feel, and act in life at any given circumstance and affects everything we do. We encourage you to talk about it, understand it, become prepared to combat it, and make strides toward healthy bodies and minds. <clears throat> this week, we encourage you to play mental health boosting bingo. You can pick up your bingo cards in the counselors, and your game cards will be due back Friday. All those that play will be put in a drawing for a prize. We also like to encourage you to take time and participate in things that help mental health like spending time in nature, drawing or artwork, talk to a friend or journaling, or even do some guided breathing exercises, stretch, or some light exercising in general are all things that can help mental health. Teachers, if you have any announcements that you would like added to the morning news, please submit them via the Google form that was shared with you. Well, that's going to do it for today in the news. We're now going to send it over to Arden in the Car Center with the latest and greatest of sports. Good morning, Farmington. My name is Arden Cater in the Card Center with the latest and greatest in sports. Coach Harper and the Cardinal baseball team will be back in action this week in the state tournament being held in Gravit. Redbirds will take on the Brooklyn We'll take on the Brooklyn on Thursday at 10 a.m. Coach Shirey and the Lady Cardinal softball team will be back in action this week as they participate in the state tournament. The Lady Cardinals will play at 10 against the Clinton Yellow Jackets. The Lady Cardinal soccer team will be back in action this week for the state tournament. The Lady Cardinals will play to Queen Thursday at 1 at Mall Mill. Coach Biggs and the Cardinal soccer team will be back in action Thursday morning at 11 for their First round matchup against Morlton. This game will be played at Mall Mill. Well, that is going to do it for us today in the Card Center. Have a wonderful Wednesday, Farmington.